Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad. So let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you will see your very first option, which says your name or your device's name. Just go into your iCloud, make that backup. If you guys have no more space in your iCloud, don't worry about it. Hook it up to your PC and use iTunes. iTunes is a free program for Macs and PCs. However, right now, if you guys have your Mac updated to the latest OS, that means you would have to use Finder in order to make that backup. Anyways, once you guys do that, go ahead, go into general, and then we're gonna tap in software update. Under software update, we should see this popping up. Some of you may see only install right now and not the download part. And that's because you may have downloaded already. Don't worry about it, just click on install. It's gonna be a quick update. We're gonna take about 10 minutes in total, depending on your internet speed, if you guys have to download this, if you just have to install this, it's gonna take you about five minutes but that depends on which iPad you guys have and how fast it's running. That means how full of storage you guys have your iPad at this point. Anyways, right now we're gonna tap on download and install. It's going to ask you for a passcode if you guys have one. Once you put that in, it's gonna start downloading. When it's downloading, it's not a big deal if your iPad turns off. However, when it's installing the update, then there's problems if it turns off for any reason. So just make sure to have it hooked up some electricity so that doesn't happen. And if that does happen, we're gonna have to restore it. And that's why you guys made that backup. So you guys can just transfer everything onto it again, because restoring will delete everything from within it. So after a few minutes, we will see this install now. Once we tap that, it's just gonna restart. So let's just tap on install now. So after you guys see the Apple logo loading bar, you will see another Apple logo loading bar and this one's gonna load a lot faster. Once this is done, we are gonna see this, enter passcode. If you guys have passcode, enter it in. We should see this right now, software update complete. Continue on. And here you guys can choose to share audio recordings or just tap in not now. So in this case, I'm just gonna share audio recordings and get started and I'm done. That would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write it down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.